I'm here to pick up the G-Wagon. I know you're not the owner of that car. I'm not leaving. I'd like to report a couple thugs that are trespassing at Jimmy's Oil Change on the corner of Mango Avenue and 7th. Hey, stop! What are you doing? Hey son, thanks for coming with me today. Oh yeah, that for sure. Uh, by the way, where are we going? We're gonna go pick up the G-Wagon. I took it for an oil change at the shop down the street. Okay. You know, now that I'm driving your car, I don't see anything wrong with it. I mean, I know that you were complaining about it earlier. Yeah, I know, but I'd rather be driving the G-Wagon. <laughs> son, that's a $300,000 car. You know what my father got me when I went to college? No, what did he get you? A bicycle. <laughs> no, really, I asked the man for a car and he got me a bicycle. <laughs> really? Yeah. You, you serious? <laughs> yeah, I'm serious. I mean, we were poor, he could barely afford a car for himself, much less one for his wife and his kids. Yeah, I get that. But you know, it's times are different now. I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to say I'm not appreciative of the car, because I am, but I'd rather be trying to do something nicer. I bet you would. <laughs> I bet you would. Well, here's a place right here. Good afternoon. What can I do for you? I'm here to pick up the G-Wagon. You? Picking up that G-Wagon? Yeah, the only one that's here on the lot. So, are you picking it up for your boss or you're a driver of some sort? <laughs> no, 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 no. It's, it, it's my car, I'm the owner. Come on, man, seriously. Man, this is our car. Why don't you believe us? Hey, son, son, let me handle this, okay? I see what you guys are trying to do here, but it's not gonna work with me. I know you're not the owner of that car. I'm sorry, what are you trying to say? That a black man can't own a G-Wagon? Please, please. I'm warning you. You and your son need to go back into your little Toyota and drive away. And if we don't? If you don't, then I'll call the police. Look, look. Can you at least check the name on the invoice? Can you at least do that for us? I know I'm wasting my time here, but just wait here. Hey son, you have your phone on you? Yeah, pull it out. I want you to record this, okay? Exactly as I thought. Your first name isn't Suzanne, now is it? No, my first name is George, George Sullivan. Suzanne is my secretary, and she's the one who brought the car in for the oil change, and it's already paid in full. Now, how would I know that? <laughs> okay, that's a great story. Now, can you please leave? I'm not leaving. Listen, your name's not on the receipt, and you know damn well you couldn't afford that car, even if your life depended on it. Look, why don't you check the registration? My name is definitely on that. Like I said, you need to leave now. Dad, what are we gonna do? I tell you what we're not gonna do. We ain't leaving. I had enough of this. Yes, I'd like to report a couple thugs that are trespassing at Jimmy's Oil Change on the corner of Mango Avenue and 7th. I asked them to leave, but they refused to. That's it, I've had it. Yep. Hey, stop, what are you doing? You can't do that. I 
I can do that, and I'm gonna show you proof that I own this vehicle. There's a registration, there's my driver's license. You see how it matches? Okay, officer. Yes, uh, I think there's a misunderstanding here. Yeah, no need to send anyone. Yeah, we're good. Thank you. You too, bye-bye. A misunderstanding? You know damn well that this was no misunderstanding. Yes, it was. You know, the minute that you saw me and my son pull up on your lot, you figured that we couldn't own a car like this. Whatever, man, whatever. Take your keys, get out of here. Hey son, why don't you go check to see if there's some oil left in that quart, huh? Yeah, Dad, there's still oil left in here. Pass it over here. You know what? I think that your outfit is a little bit too tidy to be in this vile, racist, bigoted mechanic shop. I think you need some help to dirty it up a little bit. What are you doing? What's wrong with you? <laughs> are you getting all this, son? Yes, I am. <laughs> We are gonna put this on social media so we can show everyone how much of a bigoted, racist establishment you have here. We're done. Ariba Dirty. Let's get out of here, son.